What is up guys? I'm Daddy Gamer Fred back again with another Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee discussion video and oh my god It feels so weird to say that out loud Pokemon Let's Go Eevee Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu It does have a catchy saying to it kind of weird for titles for Pokemon games, but I'll take them now I've been following the current rumors like an hawk online for these Pokemon games for the Nintendo Switch with the names being released with it being rumored to be a Pokemon Yellow remake again one of my favorite Pokemon games hell my favorite Pokemon game Pokemon Yellow I'm excited I'm very excited and today was confirmed by the same person who confirmed the names let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee that they're only gonna be using the original 151 Pokemon now again seeing this kind of makes sense for my eyes because if it's a gen 1 remake if it's a pokemon yellow remake what would you be expecting <laughs> all 800 pokemon you want to catch ultra beast out in the wild in kanto now mind you i'm not alluding to that not being the case because i do think they could introduce dlc they could introduce johto dlc down the line hell they could just be like after you beat the game here's johto or after you beat the game your pokemon bank opens and you could port everyone over so i don't think that just because this quote unquote rumor or leak person again who did leak the name so it, there is a little bit of credibility behind him just because he did say that there is only going to be the 151 based in the game doesn't mean that it's true or that it's factual and again if it is true if it is factual it doesn't mean that the games will suffer from it now mind you again pokemon has grown since pokemon Pokemon Yellow, yes. There's our monsters beyond the 150 that we are all attached to, including me. You know, I like to call myself a Pokemon fanatic, or because I always have Pikachu on my team, you call me a casual. Whatever, okay, don't mind it. But I don't, again, I don't see why this will hurt the Pokemon game. If it is the original 151 Pokemon, what I think is going on, what they're going to do to integrate more Pokemon is kind of do what they did with the island scan. It's probably have a way that each day they rotate a certain generation or a certain number of Pokemon that aren't available in the 151 that you can catch, have in the game, but they won't add to your Pokedex or anything. I do think we're going to see Pokemon appear like that. Or I do think they are going to integrate Pokemon through Pokemon Go and Pokemon Go has more than one generation now if you didn't know they're up to generation three and I do believe if we do have integration from Pokemon Go to Pokemon Switch I don't think that they're gonna just like hey no you can't bring that Pokemon in it hasn't been introduced into the Switch version yet I think that would be kind of dumb I think they would let that transpire again if the rumors are true if they do let us you know potentially trade Pokemon from Pokemon Go to Switch how weird would that be anyway if they do let us trade pokemon from pokemon go to pokemon twitch and they don't let us trade from pokemon go to pokemon go yet in the game which is a head scratcher but that's moving on to another topic again just to kind of round off my thoughts about this rumor about the 151 only uh, making appearance in these pokemon let's go pikachu and let's go eevee games i say don't worry about it trust me game freak kind of know what they're doing they know that if they don't include all 800 pokemon pokemon fans around the world are going to be tight if they can't not bring Rowlet with them on this adventure. And I think what they're going to do, again, I'm just thinking, I think what they're going to do is have you play through the base game, the story of the game, 151. That's what you stuck with. And then post game, there we go. A Rowlet flies in. You can pick a Rowlet or like how they do in, what is it? Um, Pokemon Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. After you beat the game, you go back to, you know, your professor or whatever, and he has new starters for you something something to that nature i think we are gonna see stuff like that happen within these pokemon switch games it happened before in other games like to me it shouldn't be a shocker it's not gonna be locked to these 151 pokemon i don't think we have to be too worried about that will we be stuck with the 151 during the story now i think maybe yeah 
Yeah, <laughs> I think so. But I wouldn't be too scared about that. But but let me know how you feel about it in the comment section below. Are you upset that they're going to be doing a Gen 1 remake, a Pokemon Yellow remake, and be sticking to the 151? Or do you think, like me, and think that they are going to stick to the 151 for the story, but we are going to see the, the other Pokemon join along during the post game? So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Like always, guys, I'm Daddy Gamer Fred on Instagram and Twitter. And you guys know you can bring the conversation there. I'm the American Gamer in Switzerland right here on YouTube. And yes, I'm going to be doing a ton of these Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee discussion videos. So hit that subscribe button if you want to watch them all. Also hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as growing the channel is concerned. Ring the bell if you want to be notified on the next time I drop a video. Peace. I'm going to see you guys on the next Pokemon Switch discussion videos. And oh my god, just a little side note. Kind of is still weird to say those names.